Hey everybody, Rick Needham, handicapping thoroughbred racing from beautiful Belmont Park, Belmont, New York, on Sunday afternoon, October the 2nd. This is my Equibase Winter Circle, Naira, New York Racing Association Race of the Day. Let's take a look at one of four stake races on the Sunday card, folks. Race 9, 517 p.m. Eastern Post Time. This is the Pilgrim Stakes, 8.5 furlong route test on the inner turf track, grade 3, 2 year olds, race for $100,000. Contenders number 7, Shakespeare Shalaya, number 6, State of Play, number 2, Knock Rock, and number 5, Fantastic Song. Just a quick for your information, folks the Pilgrim Stakes is named for the 1919 winner of the Remsen Stakes. Pilgrim was owned by Joseph E. Widener. Here in the 33rd running of the stakes event, number 7, Shakespeare Shalaya, sit the board in power run fashion in both of his two career starts to date, including a power run win to break his maiden his last time out. Jockey Alex Solis was in his arms for that win 13 days ago here at Belmont Park, is back today for his second ride, gunning for back to back circle trips. Number six, State of Play, the pace profile leader in this field, racing at or about today's distance of eight and a half furlongs on the dirt, is undefeated in a two-race career, including a power run win his last time out. Race nine summary, number seven, Shakespeare Shalaya, tops my contenders list, which also includes number six, State of Play, number two, Knock Rock, and number five, Fantastic Song, 7625, and the ninth from Belmont, the $100,000 grade three. Pilgrim Stakes. Some bonus long shots for you to ponder today. Let's go to Charlestown, race two, the four to one shot. Number three, Honky Tonk Moon drops in class by 15 units. Decent overall speed for this four, four and a half for a long sprint. Hawthorne race course, race five, number two, Miss Jean Louise, a four to one shot, takes a slight class drop. The overall speed leader in its allowance field spring at six for a long on the dirt. So from Belmont Park on a Sunday as we wrap up another racing week here in New York City, Rick Needham for the Equibase Winter Circle reminding you as always to please bet with your head, not over.